uh, usually lab like that lah, but uh, our class I will teach lah. Uh, and please make full yes. use of lab to develop the yes. system. I know you are very busy. Part four, eh, part five, part six lah, memang sangat sibuk lah. Dengan project, especially yang dah part six tu. You have project development. Okay. First, let me demo show you the installation part. For this class, we're going to use Power BI. But it's not limited to Power BI. You can use any other visualization tools eh? or data analytic tools. Their name slightly different but they do the same thing. You can use Tableau if you have experience in that. You can use Power BI. You can use Excel. Excel is not the old Excel. Eh? You have to import the other API, especially they call it analytic. Huh? Analytic punya um, uh, apa API that you can import and you can use. Uh, it's okay. But for this class, I'm brief you Power BI because Power BI is widely used. And then when we use Power BI, feedback from my student yang pergi industri, uh, they often say that, oh, they use it and they're very happy because they know at least they know basic and then from time to time they can advance uh, this is a feedback from student uh. and then next week i'm going to brief you there is a competition you know by using power bi i want you to also more to that competition it's organized by fskm juga uh, that is a good thing eh? uh, and the last batch student this student did attend this competition uh, akmal akmal ke? Afid, Afid, I think Afid, from a different class, from different group, right? Eh? And then they won, uh, so they won. So this year pun ada lagi. So uh, he say that he will brief you all lah on that uh, because he is uh, the, I think he is the president lah you know, for the club. Uh, he will brief you more on that one on next next week lah. It's good. It's a good exposure. Sometimes when you go for this kind of competition. It's not that about you sometimes, it's about other people. What other people have developed? What other people have done the same thing that you do? Ah, uh, From there you learn. Uh, yeah, learning ni dia bukan direct from book ke apa ke no. Dia from your observation, from people punya experience, this is where you learn. Yeah, that one will be next week. Okay, so we go for Power BI lah eh. Power BI one thing, uh, because they blue, they give you trial version for one year. And then for Power BI, it's unlimited at this moment lah, at this moment lah, that's the option. But they keep on changing lah, from time to time. And also it's cheaper, if you have to subscribe Power BI, it's cheaper. It's a 10 to $9 per, per month. Let's go back to Tableau. Tableau, Tableau dia, uh, if I'm not mistaken, $70. Uh, $70 per month, 70 USD per month uh, kalau ni baru lebih kurang berapa tak sampai 50 ringgit kan per month uh, but for our class no, uh, our class we use a free version you use free version lah kalau data you is not that big if data big, your desktop probably cannot support it okay, uh, first we go for installation eh uh, this Power BI can support Windows, uh, most of this window here, Windows Server and uh, Windows Server this because Power BI is a product of Microsoft. Uh, jadi dia memanglah boleh support lah semua dia punya, dia punya product lah kan. Uh, and then the Microsoft Power BI desktop, uh, you see it's a Microsoft, uh, uh, it's a desktop version. You are going to use a desktop version, require Internet Explorer 9 or higher. Okay. Mm, and this available 32 bits and 64 bit. I believe most computer now is 64 bit, right? Okay. And this is where you download. Like I see here, from time to time, you might change. Huh? I can not test with the log this one. If, if uh, this one cannot support, you just cari je lah yang mana-mana, eh? Hmm. Banyak, banyak. Then you choose a desktop version. Okay, then, of course, like normal, we click next. And then accept the agreement. 
and then accept the folder that you're going to install usually default je lah kan you always take default then you install and then you wait for installation okay launch uh, power bi desktop this is what you're going to get and you have this so if you see mine i already have previous work that's why you can see some part here otherwise it will be empty and uh, you are required to register so email use the ICSO email yeah, use ICSO email eh? because they want an email working email id if you use yahoo ke uh, gmail ke semua tak lepas yeah? okay uh, this one tak ada eh? this one last time i did more to uh, pensyarah that's why I giving them this. Huh? You can see lah, I think I still open this one. Kalau you boleh jumpa, uh, you boleh take out. These are just a dummy data saja. Okay. So once you done install, before I continue with the exploration of Power BI, let me introduce what is Power BI. Okay. Power BI is about providing the right data, okay, you mean you choose the right data, at the right time to the right people. People who need to analyze the data so that they can take the right decision, yes. Usually we use this kind of graph for people making decision. As an example, if we see that selling sales are going down, so you have to start doing something. If you see more and more students are not doing well during ODL or they're doing too well ODL. So we are might wonder why they're doing too well. Is it cut and paste? Uh, or they're not doing well. Why they don't understand? Or they don't, is it communication problem? Is it they cannot, you know, some people they cannot study alone. They must be in a you know, group. They must study in group. So is it because of that? Uh, we have to find out why. So why we know what the reason we formulate decision uh, to solve that issue. Power BI, BI stands for Business Intelligence. And then, uh, if you're not sure, you can always type, eh? type beside here. Eh? Uh, I will take a comment the pin, eh? So, you just type. A cloud-based business. It is a cloud-based. That one is for the one that you pick. Eh? For you free, free, it means it's a standalone. It's a desktop version. Even without internet, also you can use. So, a cloud-based business analysis and intelligence service by Microsoft. It's a cloud-based. Huh? So, when you talk about cloud-based, definitely if you pay, they give you bigger space, huh? bigger memory, bigger or fast processing, uh, uh, what do you say? Processing hardware, uh, hardware facility. The processing is uh, faster. Uh, so, that's why people are willing to uh, pay. Uh, pay yearly. Yearly pun that day we ask around 300 macam tu tu yearly. Not much eh. Uh, the bigger you, I mean you take the cheaper it become. Uh, so they, they also have limited lah how many people, how many people can use it. UITM we have this. Uh, uh, Power BI service, this one. This one uh, we have a uh, unit uh, install the kapal tu, you need pembangunan UITM tu. Ha. They want to study all the data about UITM. They want to understand what's going on so that they can formulate strategy for lecturer, for staff, for student. Ha. Including tu, uh, of course computer, of course maintenance, ha. bangunan, bangunan, everything. Man. So yes, we have this. And uh, of course limited usage lah eh. Mm. Yours is this one, eh? And then the, we also have mobile uh, for iOS and for Android. Uh. But MATLAB don't have. I'm not sure because they keep on changing. Uh. As far as I know, not yet. If you say there is already exist for MATLAB, uh, sorry, not MATLAB, uh, for Apple, please let me know, eh? Um, Okay, let's put this. 
Microsoft uh, product initially released in 2011. Dia dulu tak famous lagi lah. Dia famous pun dalam lima tahun lepas macam tu lah. Uh, created by Ron George. And Power BI feature, of course, the uh, Power BI, even though our class is data visualization, uh, we say data representation, the reason is not limited to graph. Uh, not limited to graph, but most of the time we use graph. And Power BI is graph, eh? Yeah, they support graph. They don't support other kind of uh, uh, data representation. Stack bar chart, nah, some of it, this are also some of it. And Power BI, the free version, nah, the desktop, nah, some if you want you have to pay. Uh, some of the chart you have to pay. Yeah, but however, you can also import nah, other chart from different, different system. And then in terms of data source, data source can be Excel. Hmm. Power data set, Power BI data flow, SQL server, uh, my SQL database, analysis service, and format can be different, different format. Uh, Azure have their own format, CSV, PDF format. PDF ni more or less like text lah, eh? uh, but they can also read Excel, JSON, SS is uh, also Microsoft product, right? It's a database. Uh. So CSV is also considered as text, right? Okay, and then let's see uh, Power BI architecture. How does it work? Okay, first here we have data preparation. Data preparation, it means that you collect the data. Data sometimes can, especially streaming data, data yang masuk every maybe 10 minutes, uh, every or some data masuk every one minute, one minute. Masuk. So, this data sometimes, um, you know, missing data. You collect for one day, 24 hours, but somehow three hours, there is no data. Sometimes it's because of the IoT, uh, the machine for collecting data, not functioning. Or maybe the connection itself, uh, something wrong itself, conquer. Uh, mobile ke, whatever lah, service provider that you um, apa, you subscribe. Uh, so, might be a lot of issue there. So, when that thing happen, data missing. So, what you're going to do with this missing data? Sometimes we just buang saja the missing data because we have abundance of data. But sometimes your data is not abundant. Ada sikit je data you. Uh, you only have like 300 saja. Uh, but you need to analyze. You cannot buang like 100. So what sometimes you can do is you have to, there are a lot of algorithm, uh, a lot of algorithm on this to slot this missing, missing data. Last time I, I have a PhD, uh, sorry, a master student doing research on this. Huh? Dia long gap, uh, missing data. You mean data missing for a few days. Uh, kalau sejam, dua jam, still okay. Sometimes you just take mean or average of others data to slot in kat kosong-kosong tu. Uh, but it's too long. Uh, like three days, what you're going to do? Uh, they have an algorithm on that line. So that's why you need to do some sort of preparation to the data. Data especially uh, come from different, different department, different, different organization. Example, uh, I say, I want to study uh, um, the weather, the impact of weather to accident, kemalangan, dekat Sha'alam. Uh, you see, two different department. Uh, one is from Kemalangan, probably polis lah. Uh, traffic kan, pergi register kat situ. Kes-kes kemalangan. And then weather is a different department. Ini eh? different organization. Uh, two different yes. organization. And then you get that data. And then you have to satukan, you know. You have to transform. You have to satukan this data. Hmm. And then only you can process. So they can they come from a different database. Different format. Uh, then you need all this pre-processing uh, then you extract here yeah? again you see different different format here you transform them then you store at data warehouse so for if you subscribe power bi the cloud uh, and then for your desktop your pc uh, your pc or your uh, laptop eh? so of course you have this data ready clean 
most of the time your case dah tak clean kan uh, probably it's just that sometimes you have so many columns and then for your project you do not need so many columns probably you have to buang uh, delete certain column certain attribute uh, it is a uh, your job then from this data warehouse we use power bi to visualize it will come out eh? so, so this visualize is your job your job is up to here saja lah uh, this part visualize and reporting when you have visual then you analyze it then you do report you say that sales are going down because of this 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 you just tell them sales are going down because of the increase in the tax that imposed by the government now uh, you see data from government masuk kat situ uh, data sales and data policy government policy uh, you know what a lot of things uh, combined and then because of that okay that's all you do you just do the report and then business user analyze your report understand okay and they might they themselves uh, understand after they read your report they might go to your dashboard they might go there go there they might take some zoom filter whatever they want to gain more you just highlight trigger them oh this is this is something that you know uh student um uh, okay are doing very well then you say oh doing very well is alarm sometimes it's like alarm to you then you want to know more detail then you go to dashboard then you simulate lah the system uh, things like this your job is just that eh? um and then you here lah uh, business user will make decision okay because you cannot make decision for if they are medic then uh, they are medic they are doctors you cannot make decision for them they just tell them the trend what's going on okay your job is this part here lah okay so next data connection in power bi we have uh, these are the files uh, I already briefly just now I eh, it tadi and these are uh, continue uh, with database and so on many many more some free like Impala, Impala all this free Amazon definitely you have to pay uh, Google, uh, Google not sure this one um, server SQL Smoney uh, is free okay, IBM definitely you have to pay so there are a lot of database eh, that uh, Power BI can support and then these are data set and data flow its own, uh, its own database these are other databases uh, Azure dengan Power BI they are adik-beradik lah same company they are also Microsoft and then Azure is more on machine learning eh. Azure more on machine learning uh, this one is more on um, uh, apa visualization this is more on prediction even though power bi you can also do prediction eh? uh, but they does not really directly support lah machine learning this one directly support machine learning online service okay we have github and so on others okay r script for those who learn r you can use r python for those who have less python Hadoop, hmm, this is all big data language which are free. And then dashboard development, uh, this is just a sample. Lah. This sample you can try, uh, you can try, main main lah. But honestly, data are just a dummy data. Eh? Hmm. Okay. Uh, this one you boleh tengok-tengok lah eh. I did uh, explain uh, a little bit on how to use uh, this one uh, fill here. This one what you can do is you can uh, manipulate your screen as such that you know you want to hide. You have, if I click this one, this graph hide, this this graph up here. If I want to click this one, uh, this you to call a graph. Or sometimes you can have something like this, uh, drill down chart, where if I click satu, this is kedah. Inside kedah, maybe they have another branches, maybe kedai kan, another branches. This I show you, uh, seal uh, kedai, step by step, go inside. If I click this one, they can go inside, inside, inside lagi. Ada three branches. Out of these three branches, you click lagi, they go lagi dalam. They go dalam, they go dalam. Eh? Hmm. 
Ha, you boleh tengoklah gambar tipe file linkage. Okey. So that's it eh. Hmm. Oh ya, yeah, the data is dummy eh. Uh, I think I cannot give ni. Sebab walaupun dummy data, tapi sat lagi ha. People talk is real. Hmm, nanti problem tak apa. You don't use lah this data nanti I buang lah. No, misinterpret. Sometimes online, online thing, you tahu lah. Uh, benda tak ada benda tapi bila talking about this uh, Okay um, That's about Power BI. So far ada soalan No questions regarding Power BI for now. Thank you. Okay, good If you want to ask, you can always ask here eh at the chat uh, at the chat here next uh, if you to delete i show you satu eh untuk delete hmm. okay, kenapa tak boleh ah okay here eh okay, this is to remove it hmm. okay let's see what we we can do eh hmm. first you get data click get data So you can choose your data, you can use Excel, you can use JSON, text or whatever format that you like and then you select your data, okay? So then once you select your data, you will see it, it will be here, it will be stated here. In this case, I have two data file. Huh? Two data file here, one is rating, one is here. Uh, this one is okay, rating sale is also dummy tapi you know, tak ada it does not sound, you know, uh, cliche ke apa kan. Uh, it does not sound sensitive. So, okay. Then, you have here, you can click here. This is a different view. Here where you can see your data, the content of your data. When we see sale, uh, these are all the column. And then when we see rating, uh, these are all ID and rate lah. Okay, for your information, uh, if you have data, make sure you cantikkan. Cantikkan graph you elok, -elok before you import it to Power BI. You can, you can add column, you can add more data here, but it's not as easy as uh, in Excel. Yeah, so, if you, I myself will do the same thing. Cantik-cantikkan ke Excel, uh, do cleaning everything in Excel, then on your transfer. You can also do cleaning here actually. Yeah. Because you nak you nak tambah dia punya, if you want to add column and then that column got formula, uh, dia tak semudah uh, Excel eh. But they can do, they can do. And then this is if you have more than one file, like I say just now right. Kes kemalangan pejabat balai polis from balai polis punya department. And then uh, this is uh, cuaca, uh, cuaca, uh, cuaca Malaysia from a different organization. So, you want to link them. So for cuaca, this kind of case, uh, how are you going to link from one file to another file? File Probably the date, the date of, you know, you link date. This date and this date is the same. Uh, so you nampak a relationship kat situ. Uh, okay, benda-benda macam tu eh. Mm. Okay. But for students now lah, for students, we are very structured system kan, your student ID. So if this is a benda hari for student that make payment uh, every semester, uh, then ID. And then this is your, you know, FSKM, you want to keep track of your performance kan, uh, what you get for each of the subject. So we also can link with ID. How to link very senang, click and drag sahaja. Then you establish the relationship. If you don't establish relationship, they become individual. So, for your class, huh, uh, usually student buat satu saja, huh, satu data. If you want to do both, it's okay. As an example, you say okay, you 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 have data on poverty, yeah, poverty, kemiskinan, world poverty, and then you want to say what is the relationship between world poverty and uh, commit suicide rate. Uh, 
uh, suicide rate. But definitely this data must have a link. Uh. Probably the link is a uh, is a country. Uh. Uh, probably it's a country, Malaysia, Japan, and then commit suicide rate. So you can do this. Eh? You find two database, then you combine them. Uh, but if you have one, it's good enough already. If you have two, of course, good. Lah. You, you learn more, you explore more. Okay. Next. Let's assume how to create graph. I know some of you have used Power BI, can. Uh, it's, it's quite famous, it's Power BI. Let's assume I choose this, uh, I have. So what are the field attribute parameter for this graph? Mm. Let's assume I want to choose one ID, sale, I want to say, mm, this, uh, selling price. Uh, this is branch, if I use branch, I have branch. Okay, not not uh, all support all kind of data. Eh? Uh, okay. uh, excuse me, doctor, nak tanya? Uh -uh, boleh. Yang selling price tu dia ada lambang uh, total apa tak kat sebelah tu? Sebelah ni? Uh. Uh, yes, yes. Very good. You are very observant. Uh, memang I akan explain. Uh, so nanti ya, eh, sekejap I eh, see ya. Eh. Uh, these are the graph. Okay, let's go back to this one. Now, why is selling price? Selling price here, uh, this one, uh, you click this one, you see selling price here. So, for selling price, you can take some. Or you want to say average, you see? Graph is too common. Oh, ni tak, tak banyak beza, eh? Uh, let's see. Uh, we change to median. Okay. If you change to median, ah. Uh, did I choose this one just now? Uh, median selling price, yes, it's correct. Huh? Okay, let's go to count. Uh, you see, nampak tak beza kan? Uh, the graph will be uh, beza. So count, you mean they count how many sales. Maksudnya 10 item you sell. Kalau you're talking, this is also summation. But summation of total count number of sales. A uh, 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 count. Uh, you count how many uh, you sell the product. Uh, so, maxima, uh, maxima selling price. You can also go to minimum. Uh, yeah, sub module. Eh? That's why I say not all graphs support all kind of feature. Boleh eh? Uh, so, that's why um, ID we cannot, because it's not number, you cannot do summation. You see ID, yeah? Okay. Okay. Uh, Okay, let's see ID here. Hmm, tak ada, huh? Not every, there will no one, uh, this is uh, not something that cannot be added, you cannot add. Yeah, okay. You, you can change, huh? you can change, you can modify what you want. You want mean, you want median, uh, whatever. Lah. Okay. Uh, let's see read. When we add red, okay. The graph does not change, it cannot support. Huh? Let's see others. Okay. This one can. Huh? Uh, two tips ni, you boleh tambah ataupun you boleh buang. See, the red kat situ. Nampak tak red? Huh? 24. Uh, so, this one is a selling price, subcategory and ID. Close. This one is um, close also, selling price. Uh, okay, you add this. Let's see state. Can it support state? Hmm. Let me go by this way. You mean you can only see Johor je lah. My data Johor je eh. Hmm. Okay, you can also click. Eh? This is where we call it interactive. Oh, interactive. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, okay. So remember I told you um, drill down capability, that one, drill down, uh, this is the one. Woman, man, children. Uh, I drill down lagi. Joho, Joho, Skudai. This is what I mean. Uh, you can always uh, drill down from the same graph, but you just drill down. Macam ni kan, contohnya. First I say uh, Kedah dan Joho. 
ni Kedah and Johor then I just say I want Kedah sahaja you click Kedah Kedah got Langkawi and Sungai Petani so I just want Langkawi sahaja so from this Langkawi baju lah children, men and women clothes and then let's see children clothes okay these are the things lah dalam uh, dalam nota I tu guide ada guidance lah how to achieve this one Otherwise, it be normal. It will be normal saja lah. Kita enjoy home. So, so not much different here. So I buang lah. Sub category ni. Oh, sub category okay. Stick good. Cuma sikit. Let's see what happened. Branch. Oh no, no, no. I'm using a wrong. But this one, uh, so let's see a state we want, subcategory also probably we want red. Uh, okay, if you want red, tak adalah dia punya line tu kan. Uh, maybe I also, I don't want this ID. Dah ada satu, dah cukup. Maybe state, can I want state? What will happen if I want state? Uh, okay, if I want state, depends lah if I click Johor, it will be Johor. If I say, oh no, this one combine, sorry, they combine dua-dua. They're not separate now, combine. So you can see yang bawah ni aja. Kedah. Okay. Let's see average. See this one. Okay. Uh, that's why the choice of graph is very important. Huh? That's why I discuss uh, the first part too for your dashboard. The choice of your graph. Because not every graph can see every, uh, how to say, every trend. If you use parallel coordinate, it's for to see relationship. If you use scatter plot to see the grouping, uh, the new group to scatter the to, uh, ke arah mana. So different graph have different. So depend on your research question. Apa yang you nak tengok? That's why I ask you kan, your, your exercise. You cari one data set and what you're looking for inside that data. Kita see it again. I also can click here. You can see that if I say A61, uh, A61, this is average selling. Okay. And this is for Kedah Johor. If I just want to see Kedah sahaja. Uh, Kedah and I want to see A12. Uh, okay. Uh, tadi dia... And let me go, uh, this is all. Mm, I want to see the image, okay? So, this one automatic. You don't have to worry. If you have a proper link ID, ID tadi tu, if you do not do properly, this thing will not happen. Eh? Uh, the auto filtering, we call it dynamic. Eh? This dynamic filtering will not happen if you did not link them. Mm. But you satu should be no problem. Satu file sahaja should be no problem. Whatever graph you use, as long as it come from the same, uh, uh, to say data set, it will be no worry. You can add it to me. Of course, later on you need to publish. Eh? You publish. Okay, this publish ni pun dia butuh kau kau. The first time tak ada publish. You cannot publish for desktop one. Free one tak boleh publish. Then they give. You can publish. At the time, okay. And then last semester, my students say they got limited. Uh, limited only how many times saja you will publish. Dia tak bagi banyak-banyak. And what you do is, since there are four or five of you kan, uh, one person dah publish with testing-testing, one quarter dia habis, you go to a second person. Okay. Uh, publish ni, uh, nanti I bagi you. I I, I already asked my your senior lah to, to buat satu tutorial how to publish. Nanti yang masukkan dalam uh, dalam our course information tu eh. Okay. So any question you would like to ask on this? I'm going to say notes ah. When we do uh, desktop ah, visualization, 
you must put as many graph as you want inside a single dashboard. Ha, walaupun dia ada page 1, page 2, page 3 ni kan. Tapi sebenarnya it's not that way. Ya. Visualization does not work that way. Satu graph, page 1. Satu lagi graph, page 2. Satu lagi graph, page 3. No. What we want to see, we want to see relationship among graph. Ha, if I choose in Johor's Budai. Ha, let's see average selling price. Ha. Okay, for this product, this is a product um, item lah, item lah. Okay, for Skudai, you can see lah, compare to others, Skudai jual banyak ni, compare to others, the main contribution uh, is a shoes. Okay, selling price there, this one highlighted 533, ha, ni nampak. This one tak ada. Close dia tak ada. So, this is the, you see relative to others lah. Uh, you punya Johor Skudai saja contribute, you know, half of it for this, 500 kan. Uh, very good. 533. Uh, so we know lah. So next time we should give bonus lah to this Skudai uh, for selling this product. Eh? Uh, okay, things like this. Kalau tak ada apa soalan. Oh yeah, one more thing here. Uh, this is for Mac. Hmm? Go to one graph or map. Hmm. Ah, you, you got it, got it, lah, eh. Let's see title. Uh, these are the title you like to call it to call lah. Heading three, I want to make it heading two. Mm -hmm. And then I want to change color. I want to make it red. And then I want to make it centralize it. And then size, make it bigger. Okay, nampak kan? And then border. This one tak boleh. Like I say, I'm not, they don't give you everything. Setengah you can modify, setengah okay. Not two tips, is you off it, you tak nampak lah benda-benda ni. Two tips tu kan? Two, two tips tu. Nampak apa keluar tu. Hmm. Let's see shape. Hmm. Stroke width. Uh, you nak increasekan stroke width dia. Uh, make it lagi tebal, lagi tebal, lagi tebal, lagi tebal. Uh. Okay. And then join. Hmm. Hmm. Nampak tak dia tajam. Tajam lah di seorang ujung ni tajam. We say make it round. Uh, dia bulat lah. Line style solid lah. Kalau tak nak solid, dotted. Okay, this one not support. Let's see dash. Okay, also not support. Okay, you boleh main-main lah eh. This is general. Okay. Ah, uh, I think itu saja. You nak make it bigger, boleh lah. You main-main lah kat sini eh. Hmm. Ah, focus mode. Okay, so, oh yeah, here, these the tools, right? You can import more, get more visual. Of course, here you have to, once you register, you can lah, but I tak ingat ada password. Eh? I can refer to my book, ha, password. Inside there, you can import more. Ada banyak yang canggih-canggih lagi, also given free. Also given free. Last time my student dia buat tu ada, ada, ada aquarium, dalam aquarium ikan tu jalan-jalan-jalan-jalan. Kalau ikan tu besar, maksud dia more data. Kalau ikan tu kecil, ah frekuensi dia kecil. Ah Ikan tu jalan-jalan-jalan dalam aquarium. Very cantik. Ha, you can cari ya. Eh? Uh, but again, not all is free lah. Some you have to pay. You can also import hmm. okay. from a file. Okay. Uh, visual dan uh, Power BI ni dia banyak ah uh, banyak supporting. Dia punya se dalam Google tu you Google je you nak buat apa? You nak buat drill down macam dia cakap ni pun melambat-lambat dia ajar you macam mana nak buat. Some you want to hide. Bila I click this one, this one hilang, this one hide. Ha uh, contohnya this one dia appear, this one hilang. Also can. Berbagai-bagai eh. Hmm. 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 So 
next week I show you sample. I already asked uh, one of the student. Uh, I think oh, this student dia masuk competition yang I say kan. I saw they what video and they more to you how I want it to be. Yes, what I want to be is you are computer side, uh, IT ke apa, you are computer background kan. Once you publish, I want you to publish in a web based version. Of course this one go to web dah. Kalau you keluar sekotek-kotek macam ni, dia not nice kan. Uh, I want you to have like web, web look, ada button, you click button, uh, first is a main. Second about us, you click lah button about us. Then you say okay, I want to analyze about this, uh, you click satu dashboard kat sini. I want to analyze different, uh, totally different from the first one. Kalau same, you have to put in one des, des, uh, dashboard lah. Uh, jangan asing-asingkan dia page-page tu, jangan. Kecuali you cakap, uh, okay, you want to see relationship between commit suicide and also poverty. Ah, uh, That one satu kat sini. And then the second one, you nak tengok poverty sahaja. Another one, you nak tengok commit suicide sahaja. Uh, then it's okay. Uh, you do separately. Dalam commit suicide tu, uh, ada banyak-banyak graph. You want to see is it female, is it male, their age and so on. And then poverty pun you want to see is it urban area, is it rich people, you know, that town pun ada kemiskinan. Uh, and show you who are they, what background are they, huh? you nak study, uh, that one can. Um, that one you have button, uh, you click the button, it go to next. You click the button macam web, uh, gitu. So, uh, I see the one that the student do, dia menang tu, dia lagi cantik compared to my previous student. Uh, actually, I also have other sample from my previous student. Yang tu nanti, nanti I also demo to you, dekat-dekat nanti lah eh. So, I give you the best dulu. Uh, this one I think so far is the best. I give that one first next week. Okay, dah tak ada apa dah ni. Uh, dekat, dah satu jam dah eh. What I want you to do is, for this class, you dah ada data kan? Hmm, you dah ada data. Uh, what I want you to do is work in your group. Uh, the data, the other class asks uh, how big or how small. Make sure you must have as many columns as you can find. And make sure there is also benefit to Malaysia lah. Hmm? Not directly to Malaysia, maybe uh, Asia, Asia Tenggara. So, uh, for the first class now, you put this in in the Google eh. Hmm. I think you all ada kan, you 5, 2, 5, 9 nak eh, buat sample kan. I tengok, I tengok ada yang dah letak dah. Hmm. 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 Let's see this one. Oh no, yours is not this one. Dah banyak sangat, I dah tak ingat dah. Bukan tak ingat nak kena cari sekejap eh. Hmm, let's see from here lah. Hmm, that one. Oh, okay. This one can be. Oh, this is project. Okay, project betul. So, you 259 kan? Ah, you dah fill in dah. Okay, very good. Hmm. So, 230. Hmm. Okay, very good. You also have fill in. Uh, okay, so this is week one. Uh. I always take Monday. Then you fill in the next week. Uh. Uh, okay, most of you already uh, the type of data. Very good. Okay. Now uh, you also have two options here. Eh? Hmm. And good. So for next week, remember I told you I want you to Fine, what you going to do with your data? Huh? The one is for next week. We just fikir-fikirkan lah. This one lagi-lagi-lagi lah eh. You fikirkan with this data yang you cari ni, what you going to do with it? Apa you nak tengok sebenarnya? That become your problem statement. Problem is like here kan, uh, they have this to build a profile on customer. Uh, they want to build profile on customer that will churn or uh, stay by analyzing the variable, variables. You mean that the customer keep on jumping from one company to another company. This one is true huh, for America, huh? their phone company. Dia tukar-tukar-tukar je. Oh, sekejap dia tukar because very senang saja. You check call aja hari ni, you want dia just tukar esok dah. The, I mean on the spot, huh? on the day itself, you dah switch dah to a new company. As simple as that. 
Ah, so customer keep on jumping. So they want to retain customer. Ah, how to retain customer? You have to understand what customer preference. You need to under analyze who are the customer who stay with you and who are the customer keep on jumping. What is the percentage of jumping? Ah, and why they keep on jumping? If the you see that elderly example, they don't jump so much. Then you have to take care of them. Ah, bila bila macam tu lah. And how are you going to take care of them? The elderly, you have to give a special package for elderly. If the one that maintains are uh, youngsters, then you have to give special package for youngsters. You must know what they like. Ha, jadi benda macam tu lah, you want to understand because you want to retain customer. Problem dia adalah customer keep on jumping. Uh, this one decide which movie are suitable to be screened in the cinema. Uh, some they say they want to make movie. What kind of movie? There are many genre of movie. Is it love? Is it action pack? Is it apa? What a customer want? What a, you know? A society want from this movie? So they study. So that when they make movie, uh, they, they want to make money, money right? Uh, so the reason is they want to make money is because the costing of developing a movie is not cheap. It's very expensive. Of course, they want a high return in order to have a high, 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 high return. They need to understand who are there customer who watch the movie uh, many things like this uh, the hospital uh, has stroke based on the data collected uh, okay this is for hospital hmm. yeah, there is a problem a uh, problem you want to solve uh, when you have problem it means that your dashboard must solve this problem uh, whatever problem you want to know this is general And then next, after you have general, from this general, you kupaskan very detail. Apa sebenarnya nak tengok in very detail? Ha, itu step by step lah. Okay, apalah, we go step by step. So for today, you have to fill in this one. You have to tell me, what is a problem? Uh, usually, I will assess this by Friday. Eh? Uh, I will tengok lah by Friday. I will tengok, and next week, you explain to me again eh. Oh yeah, this week I tak tengok lah sebabnya you, I want you to present. Because you all tak present apa lagi, I want you to start talking. Uh, start talking to me. This one you have to present to me next week. Uh, next class, lab hour. Uh, so you have one week. Uh. By the meantime, you see je lah. Uh, you see, eh? mm, usually, uh, I will by Friday. Uh, by Friday, next week lah. Next week by Friday, I want to see eh. If you ada, I bagi markah. You tak ada, I tak bagi markah. Ha, itu sahaja. Even though after I bagi markah, you masukkan pun, you dah tak dapat markah lah. Itu macam biasa dia. Um, this one you do presentation next week eh. Hmm. Itu macam lah. Okay, that's all I want you to do. We still have one hour. Discuss lah, cari betul-betul lah. Uh, because... Sometimes student in the middle, like maybe with empat ke, with lima ke, they then they realize that data tak boleh cukup nak buat analysis and they want to change. I say it's okay, you want to change. But sayanglah sebab you also have to do some other research. Huh? Like example, we're talking about churn. Uh, then you have to know, this one is America. You have to go and dig out lah, America, what are the company, uh, how many company they have, uh, macam tu lah. Uh, the nature, if you're talking about ni, eh, benda ni, hospital patients, money stroke, then you have to dig out some information. Mm, then you have, if you change your data, you have to dig out again lah. Uh, itu je lah, but you are allowed lah to change. Mm. Yeah? Uh, because if you want to do introduction, you tak boleh ambil daripada data. Introduction you, you have to do some reading. Okay, you can do some reading today and so on eh. Uh, but for next week presentation ini je lah. Presentation, uh, you tak payah buat slide ke apa for first presentation. You nak buat pun okay je. Bila you buat sometimes assist you lah. You just like you tell me, I'm going to use this data. And then you tell me what is the problem, what you are generally, what you are looking for uh, from this data. Itu sahaja, okay. And then the later on, Uh, this one, hmm. then when you start writing, uh, when you start writing, you also have to give me something like this, eh? uh, your link, lah, your own, Google Drive or your own group. Uh. 
individual group ah ha, you give it to me sometimes you tak nak individual you nak satu kelas nak satu ah ha, tak kisahlah how you want to organize kan satu kelas satu google drive dan semua buku kat situ so that you can share of course you cannot tiru ah ha. definitely title lain lain atau lain lain of course you cannot tiru it's just that you can help seeing that oh buat macam ni then you see your friend eh macam rupanya ai salah rupanya kena macam ni ha. ataupun you see your friend buat different you say eh kenapa you buat macam tu Then the fellow, eh sebenarnya salah, uh, okay, madam cakap bukan macam tu, madam nak macam ni lah. So probably you want to help each other. Sebab you are working remotely kan. Kalau dalam kelas lab tu, you jalan jalan je lah. Memang jalan, semua orang jalan sana sini je. Ha, tak kisah because I want you to work in the group, help each other. Now this generation dah tak ada dah. Nothing you can work alone. You main game pun collaborative game kan. So everything is, uh, everything become specialized. Now this more specialized. Even I have a student yang kena kerja, dia punya job adalah testing software sahaja. They don't develop, they just testing sahaja. Yang student multimedia, they, they, they just design screen sahaja. Ha, sometimes I contact-contact, dia kan student-student FYP yang lama tu, katanya you buat apa, then they say, oh, they just design sahaja design the screen cantik-cantik semua then programmer like you always fit in the coding kat belakang tu and then siap the coding send to another department just testing sahaja ha, very specialized you cannot work alone now this eh hmm. okay uh, itu sahaja but this one later on lah uh, what I'm trying to say that these are the things that going to happen during our lab eh But I want you to write during lab hour. Please use the two hours for developing your project. Uh, I'm not teaching much. Huh? Even though face-to-face -face, I'm not teaching. Uh, in the lab, huh? in the real lab. It's more spending time on developing and then you all masa tu dalam lab. Huh? You all together, uh, senang jumpa, buat semua together sekali. Now no choice lah. But still, eh, work together. The time is allocated for you. Please use it wisely. Jangan kata macam nanti lah, weekend lah. Betul saya nurang ni, dia nak tengok minggu depan. Memang nak tengok minggu depan. But don't cross that. Nah? Buat aja. Ada masa buat aja. Okay. Itu sahaja. Dia uh, have one more hours to go. Ada apa-apa nak tanya I lagi? No questions for me. Thank you. I realize that I only have one student. I keep hearing the same voice. Others, uh, others can you type? type, type. No questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. okay. So far, okay. Okay, great. Boleh lah sikit kat tepi tu. Janganlah biar saya sorang-sorang kat sini. Uh, okay, no question. Very good. Irma Irham. Uh, Iqbal, okay Adam, hmm. Iqbal ada dua eh, oh no same person, sorry same person. Hmm. Okay, uh, Irshad, okay. Okay kalau tak ada apa, I leave, uh, I leave you here. I exit dulu, you all nak continue dalam ni pun boleh or you want to create your own group and start developing your project. Okay, okay bye. Assalamualaikum. 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 Oh ya, yeah. kita suka ni dengan Tash Beki Farah eh. Tash Beki Farah. Ya, tadi laju je eh. Start kelas eh, tak jumpa kata baca patin hop tu. Okay, goodbye. Okay, Exit first. Have a nice weekend, eh? You all, it's a loser the weekend. Bye, Doctor. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you, Doctor. You too. Thank you. Doctor, dah keluar dah. Clear.